So I want to make a quick video. It's uh, one of those synchronicities. I seem to be having a lot of those. But um, a YouTuber I follow called Pockets of the Future, and I'll put a link below. He made a video about um, the pyramids, and he talks a lot about like Illuminati stuff and the connection with um, all these Hollywood people and just how they're all they really push the whole satanic thing and all that. Um, he, he does a good job describing that, a lot of detail. But I wanted to talk about something. He was talking about the pyramids and how there's such incongruity in archaeology and, and what they've told us is reality. Um, just based on the pyramids alone, you could, you could make the case that we've been completely lied to about what our, you know, ancient history is and um so it's funny because i have a friend i uh, trained jujitsu with and he came over and we were talking about stuff we talk about stuff like this sometimes not all the time but just sometimes it'll come up and we were talking about you know i, I was i was basically saying i mean look how western civilizations in decline and and he was like he was like really you really think that and it's funny because it's so obvious right i mean we're in decline and he just was oblivious to it like he, he couldn't believe what i was saying was true but if you look at what's going on in the world i mean to me it's obvious and and uh people who are you know studying this stuff have been talking about there's a lot of youtube stuff about the decline of Western civilization and how, you know, what the decline of Rome looked like and how similar the, you know, the decline that we're having now is. There's a lot of parallels, you know, the, um, the fiat money system, the corruption in government, the military overextension that we have right now and endless wars and the debt. And so, but what I wanted to say about the pyramids is we were talking about how, you know, I was saying how that these ancient civilizations lived before us and, and they were very advanced. And he was like, well, well, where's the proof? Where's the proof of this? And I think you could just look at the pyramids as proof. I mean, think about these monolithic structures that were built that have withstood the test of time. And you know, they, they, they claim that the pyramids are, you know, 5,000 years old or 4,000. That's crazy. They're just much older than that. I mean, they're at the, at maybe 20,000, 30,000. Who knows? They could be 100,000 years old for all we know. And um, the technology to build those, if you imagine them being built 100,000 years ago, and they still are here on this planet. So he was basically saying that, you know, um, when he said, where's the proof? I said, well, look at our own civilization. You know, if you took away, if, if everything just ceased right now and there was no, and, and human beings just left and everything stopped and you came back in 10,000 years, there would be barely a trace of this civilization. The houses would be gone. The metal would be gone. Everything would be dissolved. And that's, that's without cataclysms. Imagine if there was, you know, pole shifts and cataclysmic events and um, where whole continents are lifted up and whole continents sink. There would be no, there'd be no evidence. So I think the evidence is pretty, pretty much out there. I think it's being covered up by archaeology. But it's just something I want to, I'll put a link to his video. It's pretty interesting. It's just funny how people are in such denial about if you just start using your common sense and, and, and your, you know, your, your intellect, it's obvious. I mean, it's obvious. I mean, we're being, we're being visited now by somebody. Somebody's visiting us, you know, whether it's uh, off-world technology, which I believe a lot of it is, or whether it's just man-made technology, the UFO phenomenon is not going away. I mean, it's, it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So it's pretty obvious that somebody's, you know, visiting us. All right, that's all for now.